<clears throat> Just thought I'd give a little help on a couple of the Pythagorean theorem type questions, uh, especially a couple of the, the special situation ones. Um, this question right here is actually one of those. When something is launched straight upwards, what do we do with that? What does that mean? So it's really helpful to start with a sketch. Uh, so we know that here's a marble. And just imagine our marble launchers, right, or whatever else. And it's going straight up, and it has a velocity of 21 meters per second. Okay. Um, a straight up means an angle of 90. So you have to remember that an angle of 90 means straight up. If it was an angle of zero, that would mean straight side to side. Now, how do you do that? It doesn't make a triangle. There are no sides because you only have one line that's pointing straight up. You can't make an angle with that. Let's just say you didn't know that. Trigonometry still works for you. So remember, sine is always the up and down portion of our projectile. Right. So if we say the sine of 90 degrees equals our, you know, what is this? Well, this is our VY divided by the hypotenuse, which I guess technically would be 21. Right. And if we do cosine of 90 degrees to find the VX, well, let's see what this gives us. Okay. So sine, take 21. Sine of 90 degrees actually gives you the number 1, right? And so if you take 21 times 1, we have sine of 90 degrees equals 1. So we have 1 equals Vy over 21. When I multiply both sides by 21, and then that tells me the Vy is 21. Think about why that makes sense. All of the velocity is straight up. So if all of the velocity is straight up, all 21 of that is going to be the y velocity. Okay, now let's think of the x. Remember, x is the side to side. Well, if I do cosine of 90 on my calculator, what number does it give me? It gives me 0. So I'm going to end up with 0 equals vx over 21. And when I multiply both sides by my 21, what's going to happen? I'm going to get 0 equals Vx. Well, why does that make sense? Because none of the marble speed is in the side-to-side -side direction. It's all up and down. So that's, uh, that's how you do that. Uh, when it says check for Pythagorean theorem, you can't really do anything with that. I and mean, if you, you could, I suppose. So if I had this where the Vy is 21, this is 0, right? We're saying, OK. A squared, we'll make this our A, we'll make this our B, and this is C. A squared plus B squared equals C squared. We're going to have 0 plus 21 squared equals C squared. So think about that without even doing the calculation. What number does 21, or what number does C have to be? It has to be 21. So um, anyway, that's how you would do that. So hope that helps. Let me know if you have any more questions. Thanks.